Hello there lads and lassies, welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's. I always swore I would never play this one again, but I just wanted a quick look back at the original. I played this many years ago, and um, it's been a long time since I played it, I've been playing the VR version lately, so I just thought, you know what, let's go back and find out what actually made this scary. So let's click on New Game. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Family Pizzeria looking for security guard to work the night shift 12 to 6. Monitor cameras and you can just go completely blind! You know, whatever, 12am first night. Make sure my volume's up so I can listen for things. Because that's one thing I've discovered, a lot of this game is about listening for things. And I'm going to talk all the way through it. Alright, wow. We never knew we could do that the first time we played this game. There we go. Okay, where's the phone? We turn the fan off. Hello. 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 Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. That's cool. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as yeah. a matter of fact. So I know it can be a bit overwhelming. But yeah, I'm totally. Tell you, there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So let's just focus. Oh yeah, I forgot the mouse came out of the screen. Okay. Uh, let's see. First, there's an introduction. Got a dining area, backstage, restrooms, kitchen, East Hall. It's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, yeah. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. A magical okay. place for kids and grown-ups alike. Where fantasy no coins to pick up on this one. There's Carl. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or a person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as Sometimes they look at you, it's kind of weird. Chica's- I never noticed Chica had eyebrows before. Blah blah blah. Now that might sound bad, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's really nothing to worry about. I'm not worried uh, at all. The animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. Yeah, so yeah, I'm more likely. These characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and you need to show them a little respect, right? Okay. Okay, yeah. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something okay. about their servos locking up if they get turned off for too long. Yeah, it makes uh, sense. They used to be allowed to walk around during the day too. But then there was the bite of 87. Yeah. Bite of 87, my god. It's, it's been a long time since I've heard about that. The lobe, you know? Yeah, and yeah. Concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. Mm hmm. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Yeah. Since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Yeah. Um, now that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wire, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. Yeah. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those. I'd rather not have that happen. The only part of you that would like to see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth pop up the huh. mask. <laughs> yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. Well, it would have been hey, something that would have been, you know, extra money for me. Tomorrow, uh, check those cameras and remember to close oh. the doors only if absolutely the necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. Bonnie's on the move. Okay, that's fine though. But yeah, I mean, there's a lot of different things in this game that, that you really didn't notice. I mean, it's it's insane the amount of lore that came from just this little simple game. Okay, and Foxy's still there. Bonnie's still there. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with knowing that Bonnie's still there. I mean, basically, as long as I keep my eye on things, everything should be fine. Freddy doesn't really move, and Foxy doesn't move at this time of day. Supposedly. Right, so we're, we're already at 2am. Um, so I'm kind of fun with that, you know. It's fun with that? Fine with that. 
Chica's still standing there. I've just eaten bib on. Oh, he's on the move. He's right there. Okay, it's fine. Yep, you can just stand there, that's fine. Just make sure, I mean, we're at 3 a.m., we've got 60% power, and I'm kind of, I'm okay with that. Oh, where is he now? Oh, he's getting closer. Oh, Freddy's looking at us. That's not good. Okay. Gotta make sure, see where he is. Okay, he's over there. He's over there. Where's Chica? Chica's up there. Right, that's fine. Gotta keep our eye on everything. 3 a.m. is a good time. Where? Where's he gone? Oh dear me. Yeah. Just keep my eye on everything over here. In the VR version, it's easier to see them walking by or hear them walking by. Why well, is he's over there? That's okay. Freddy's still fine. Chica's right there. Chica's getting closer. Okay. I heard the footsteps. Oh, <laughs> this is actually quite freaky. It's actually a lot more freaky than I remembered. Okay. I thought he was going to be there. He's not though. Somebody's coming closer. I can hear them. I can hear the footsteps. I thought it was going to be Chica there, but no. Nope. Don't know why I keep doing that, but I do. Oh, he's over there. Where's Chica gone? Wait, we're keeping a 39% power at 4 a.m. I think we're going to make the first night no problem. And I don't know if I'm going to do like two nights at the moment. I think I'm just going to. Spend my time, you know, trying not to get killed on the first night. And again, with anything else, if, if this does well, I might continue with it. We'll see how it goes. I do warn you though, this game does anger me. Okay. We're alright, we've got 33% power left, we're at 5am. Bonking in us for good luck. Yeah. Well, she's in the kitchen. That's okay. Freddy's still there. Right. Well, she's in the kitchen. And we're okay with this. Yeah, there he is. Okay. We just click on the light, we can see his hand still there, so that's good. She's still in the kitchen. Yeah, okay, we're okay. We're all good. We're all good. Yes! Happy, happy, fun times. Happy, happy, fun times. With Freddy Fazbear. He's still there. He's not there. He's still there. Oh, she she was being on the move there. Okay. Oh, 6 a.m. Well then. There you go. Night one of Five Nights at Freddy's. So we're back in the main menu. So night one. It is actually as freaky as I remember it. I mean, after 
six years of not having played this game and having refused to play it after Sister Location. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll go back to it properly? It really all depends on you lot. Depending on the amount of views this gets, I have a number in my head. If it gets past that number, I'll play more. If it doesn't, well, them's the breaks. That's just how it goes. I am going to continue with the VR version though, uh, because I'm really enjoying that. But um, as it goes with this one, I'm not entirely sure what's going to happen with it. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Please hit that like button. It helps this video to get seen in the algorithm. And please do share this around with your friends. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. But until then, bye-bye.